Hey besties, what's up? Welcome and welcome back to my channel. I am Ryan for real. And if you are new to this channel, I ask that you subscribe before you leave. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when I post another video. Y'all, I, I already know. <laughs> I already know. You may think as though I left you for dead. It didn't happen like that. It didn't go down like that. Today is Friday. It's officially one week since I've been in my new home. And I must say, you guys, I love it. It is so peaceful. It is so wonderful. It's just so me. But I am extremely excited today because of two things. One, today I ordered my Renaissance concert tickets, period, okay? Moving on. The other thing is my furniture come in today. I ordered two couches that I will have to assemble myself. So that would be pretty exciting. I was actually just sitting in my room chilling, you know, just planning everything out for the weekend. And um, I was like, dang, I really should pick up my camera and film. So when I picked up my phone, I just got a notification that said that my package is on the way via FedEx. I was not expecting my couch until next week, but I'm so glad that they are coming today. Now, the only thing about the delivery is that they're coming one at a time. I ordered two couches from the same website and they are coming separately. I don't know what they got going on with that, but it's not a big deal. It gives me something to do today and it gives me something to look forward to today. Once I get the couches up, Hopefully my big sis Sharika will be able to come over and you know give her vision of how everything should be. I don't know if she is extremely busy today. I did talk to her briefly this morning. We had a short conversation because um, usually at this time she is about to get ready to go to the gym. So of course I'll hear more from her later. So you guys, my day will definitely be around getting everything together as far as the furniture goes. Once I get the furniture up, I will be out to search for a freaking rug. I have an idea of where I wanna go to search for a rug. I'll bring y'all along, of course. Then I need to go to the head store because, honey, it's giving very much not a natural blonde. <laughs> Y'all see the dark roots? Yes, I'm going to go ahead and give myself a touch up. You know, I'm not opposed to the dark roots with the blonde hair. It actually looks pretty good to me, um, especially when I get my hair cut, which I need to set an appointment. That's another thing I need to put on. My, that is definitely another thing I need to put on my checklist. But let me text him right now. All right, y'all, let me get myself together. I actually need to move a lot of stuff. As y'all see, it's still some things out here that I did not put up. I have so many clothes. These are clothes, okay? It's not trash. Clothes in there, clothes. My Amazon packages that my bestie and my family members had sent me um, from my registry. I appreciate y'all. We are definitely going to dig into that later. Just a storage bin hanging out. Some more clothes. Some more clothes, more Amazon packages. No, but for that night that I um, moved in and I filmed that video, I was knocked out probably like five to six hours. I woke up, it was about two o'clock, 2 a.m. in the morning. I got up and I just started cleaning. I grabbed my gloves, I grabbed a sponge and a whole lot of bleach <laughs> and spray. And I cleaned up, I swept, I mopped, I took care of everything. But I am gonna go over the living room once again, y'all give me some advice in the comments on how to really take care of hardwood floors. This is my very first time ever caring for hardwood floors. And even though I sweep and mop, it still gives very much dust. <laughs> and I can tell because of how my feet feel and how my socks look, if you know what I mean. So give your boys some advice. I really need it. But anyway, the couch is set to be here in about two hours. So let me go ahead and finish cleaning up my little area. And then I will be back so we can assemble this couch, y'all. Y'all better help some. Yeah. 
Okay, you guys, so as y'all seen, my couch came. I'm happy. Now, the box was heavy, it's like 86 pounds each. So I purchased two couches, and lucky y'all, y'all gonna sit here and help me build it, so let's go. Okay y'all, so this is how the couch looked. So it definitely have that low seating that I was looking for. The only thing you sit on it is definitely a sleeper's couch. Here are the armrest slash pillows. I have it counter corner just to give it a little character. On this side, you can see it's kind of slanted as well. Y'all see what I mean, how it looked when it's slanted? So cute, right? The other couch is on that side. I'm thinking about having one with the armrest down. It has an armrest and then you can put your drinks there for guests. So when you put the armrest down, it make it look like a love seat. You see what I mean? And then that one would be regular. I think I'm gonna just leave both of them up. <laughs> All right, so yes. So I finally have my couches in here. I'm so excited. And I'm even more excited because tomorrow I will be looking for a rug for the center. Good morning, besties. Good morning. It is Saturday morning and I'm actually headed out the door. So this is what I have on the agenda today. First things first, I'm going to go and pick up some crawfish because I had a wild week. And y'all know when I'm... Well, I'm going through some things. I got to have my crawfish. So I'm going to go and grab some crawfish. After that, I'm going to head to Ollie's to find a nice rug for the center of the floor. I'm looking for a center rug that is much lighter. Um, I'm trying to steer away from black. We're going to bring some colors out, all right? After that, my mom wanted to take me to the plant nursery to find a gorgeous plant for my living room. I'm looking for something more like a birds of paradise, something big. And the birds of paradise, that's, that's one plant that I know that is great in the inside and is huge. So we'll see y'all, we'll see. But let me go ahead and head out. Where's my bike? I'm sure it's on my door. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's cold outside, so I'm rocking pajamas like real quick. Let me show you what I got on. I'm going to put y'all in the mirror. Y'all might see how messy my bed is in the background, but we ain't going to worry about that. Yeah, so this is what I got on. Sweatshirt, my Michael Kors um, pajama pants, and my coach bag. <laughs>
Safe Flit. I am back and I have some goodies to show y'all. First things first, um, before I show y'all what I purchased today, I have my Amazon registry items on the side. I think I'm gonna do a separate video for that because I didn't want to like cram everything into this video. I really want to have something for y'all to look forward to and um, spread my content out um, as much as I can for the week. So, you know, so I won't go missing and y'all send out sky signals to my sister and myself. So, that's not shade at all, y'all. It's just a key key because a lot of you guys have been inboxing me on Instagram. And my sister just told me yesterday that y'all been inboxing her looking for me. But here I go. All right, first up, I want to show y'all the rug that I purchased from Ollie's. Y'all, when I seen this rug, I melted. It was only $50. And... Here it is. Y'all, the camera isn't doing it any justice. Let me open up my blinds real quick. Turn on some light, why so dark? I should have put on one of my studio lights. Y'all, this rug is so gorgeous. So, ironically, I seen a pillow on Amazon that have the exact same pattern going on. So, within the pattern, you have your beige, your white, your cream, gray, and black. I don't know if y'all can see it. I'm sure when I edit this video, I'll probably be able to see it. But it's not. I don't see it on the on my little flip part. But y'all, when I see this, well, I was like, ah! <laughs> so so cute. Let me show y'all my plants. So instead of going with the Birds of Paradise, I decided to get this gorgeous palm. She is so healthy. Look at her. Super gorge. <laughs> I love it. I just found the pot. The pot is a little rusted, dusted, and old. I got it out the yard at my mom's house. And I'm going to spray paint it just to give it like a nice elevated look. I'm going to spray paint it and let it dry out. And I'm going to put this baby into it. And we're going to figure out a name for her because she's so gorgeous. Yes, you are. And this baby right here, I know this plant looked very familiar to you guys. This is a peace lily. I got him for free. I think I'm going to call you Jacob. <laughs> I need to figure out some names for my new babies. But um, yes, this is a peace lily. Very healthy. And if you are familiar with the peace lilies, you know like once the flower bloom, it's very fragrancy. And I just pray that my family and friends that are allergic to air and plants <laughs> do not have an allergic reaction um, towards this when it blooms because I'm really looking forward to it. Both of the plants that I have, they require very little maintenance. I'm very familiar with taking care of both of these plants. Both of them was watered before I purchased them. The lady did tell me that I probably don't have to water them until like two weeks. So I'm gonna make sure I stay on top of the maintenance for these bad boys because they are so beautiful. They are very healthy. And the lady at the nursery, she took great care of them, as y'all see. So with them having a new home, I plan to really, really look after these plants. These are my new babies. <laughs> so with that being said, let's go ahead and get this world down and see what it's getting. Like I said earlier, the carpet, obsession. Okay, I love it. Now, as far as the table go, I don't know if I want another table. I think I just want a solid black table um, because this this table is just giving very much old school to me. But the people that seen it, they love it. I don't, I'm not loving it. Don't, don't worry about that centerpiece. I was just playing around, you know, trying to see if I wanted to put something down there. But it's just not... The table itself is not doing it for me. Now, as far as the couch go, I put those pillows there just to see what color that I want to actually add as far as the throne pillows go. I think I'm going to go a little lighter than this brown. I think I'm going to go a little lighter than that, um, but that's just to test it out. Here's like a better look for y'all. It looks nice to me, but I it, it, it's just too dark. It's way too dark. 
And especially with my picture up here, this is not gonna be over here, y'all. This is just here because I just wanted to see how the entertainment center would look because I wanted something under the TV once I get it mounted over there. It's just a little too busy to me. And I'm thinking about moving like the couch and the rug over a little more towards the wall, not directly on the wall, but a little towards it. And then we're gonna see how that look. Um, but yeah, just ignore that. That that won't be here. Now, say for example, if I was to use that jazz picture, it'll go perfect with the vibe in here, especially when I get all of my plants. But I don't want it to be too, too warm. And when I mean too, too warm, I mean like these warm colors, these earthy tones. I don't want it to be too much brown. I don't want it to be too dark. I need some light in here, you know what I'm saying? So this is when my sister Sheree could come in. I really need her eye as far as, you know, pulling out some creams and some whites. Um, and maybe a little gray, like that oatmeal gray, you know what I mean? She approved the look because like I said, this is something that I was actually going for. Um, but I just want to lighten and brighten it up a little bit because it's, it's too dark for me. And I think it's going to start with that picture. I need that out of here so I can really focus. <laughs> I don't know. So, yeah, y'all, this is how the living room looks so far. Again, this is not the final vibe. We're just getting an idea. And, and I'm really starting to get into it. Um, but I do need Big Sis to help. <laughs>